back today with another taste test. It's a holiday taste test, but everything I purchased is all one flavor, the same flavor. And when I thought of it, it sounded like a really good idea. <laughs> but when we were setting up, I was like, why did I do, why did I buy this much? I don't understand. Because you, you're crazy. I am crazy. I just get <laughs> so into the holiday spirit. And then when I saw how much it was, like, different items that were available. I was like, oh, I need this and this and this. <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel like I'm going to be sick. So we have here after one, this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Baker's dozen different items to try. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And Paige was just like, no, that's too much of the same taste for me. I'm not doing it. <laughs> okay. So if you already read the title, it is all peppermint. Cause that's a traditional Christmas flavor, I feel like. Mm -hmm. So of course we picked up candy canes, kind of just to start us off. And I think what I want to do is, sorry, I got an itch on my nose. Itchy, itchy, itch. Um, I want to see who has the best peppermint flavor. Even okay. though I guess it's going to be kind of hard once you see the, the items right. that I got, but whatever, we're just going to go with it. Okay. This is all peppermint flavored items. And there were more that I could have picked up. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of tried to get that. like different varieties in the peppermint. Yeah. So let's go ahead and do candy canes. Okay. Do candy canes first. And then we can put the rest of these on our tree. Because we don't have any candy canes on our tree. We'll just open one yeah, and sure break one. it. And these are Target's candy canes, I believe. It doesn't say on here, it just says peppermint candy canes, but I did purchase them at Target. Okay. You want to break off a piece for me? No, we're married. <laughs> Come on, you can eat after me. Mm. That's peppermint. I haven't had a candy cane in a long time. Well, in a year. Yeah, I've had mints, like peppermint mm -hmm. mints. That's a peppermint candy cane. Yep. All right, so now we know. Yeah, that's like the traditional. Like yes, this is traditional. This is the, uh, the gold standard of peppermint flavor. Okay. So, everything's the same. What do you want to do first? Let's knock out these. Knock out these? Yeah. Okay, so Peeps, <clears throat> back in the day when Peeps first came out, it was just marshmallow. Yep. But I feel yeah. like the past maybe three, two or three years, they've started to really dip into different flavors and things like that. So this is Peeps candy cane flavored marshmallow and it's dipped in chocolate. And then it also has, it looks like candy cane pieces, sprinkles yeah. or something on it. I think Peeps are very, uh, they're not controversial, but they're very divisive. Some people like love Peeps and some people just hate Yeah, I think, I feel like this is one of the foods that there's no like, eh, it's okay. You either like it yeah. and you're going to buy it or no, no, no peeps for me. I love peeps. Should do obviously. one? Obviously. Oh, yeah. I smell the chocolate. Mmm, that smells good. <laughs> yeah. It's good. It tastes a lot of chocolate. But, mm -hmm. but the candy canes are really strong. Yeah. So, I taste more chocolate than candy cane in this. I smell more chocolate too. Yeah. But they're good. I mean, they're good. It's just the candy cane flavor is very faint. So, if you're not big on the mint aspect, you pr you'll probably like these. Yeah. They're more chocolate than anything. They're and tasty. it's got, you can taste the sprinkled sugar <clears throat> on top. I always think of these as like, um, slippers. And do like little bunny <laughs> slippers. slippers. Yeah. Not bunny, but chicks. Yeah. Little chick slippers. All right, that was my choice. All right, I want to do these Junior Mints. Peppermint Crunch. Mm -hmm. So Junior Mints are already minty, mm -hmm. but these have like peppermint made with a real candy crunch. So I'm assuming they have the it's, peppermints in it. Looks like it's on top of it, maybe. Maybe. Cool. So let's see. I like to get Junior Mint though sometimes. Yeah. Or a York, York peppermint patty, that kind of stuff. Ah, there's one for you. One for me. 
Yep, we're getting on to on the on the chocolate mm -hmm. coating. There's no crunch. At least Ooh. mine mine didn't have any crunch. There's a little crunch. But they all look different. Like obviously it was just sprinkled in in the making facility. Mm. They taste <clears throat> like normal ginger mints to me. A little bit. I, I wonder though if that peppermint candy cane is still still kind of there. Yeah. Like we should have maybe cleansed our palate. Did, did the the candy cane last. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> but I, it, it's minty for sure. Yeah, it's minty, but it tastes normal to me. Okay. All right, let's do some more chocolate. Okay. Or do we want to do a drink? Yeah, I only have three drinks. Let's do a drink. Okay, let's do a drink. We do have drinks. Okay, which so one So let's... These are probably so hot. Yeah, let's do the chocolate milk. Okay. I'm going to show that. Yeah, so we have some True Moo chocolate milk with peppermint. Yeah, I've never seen this before. Like, I don't remember it last year. I feel like it's brand new. Limited edition. But who knows? My kids weren't seriously into chocolate milk last year, so I might not have seen it. Doesn't smell peppermint. I'm not a big chocolate milk fan. Love but. chocolate milk. Truman is really good, too. Yeah. I don't like it. Do you like it? Oh, I mean, I like chocolate milk. Yeah. It doesn't taste very peppermint. Mm -hmm. It just tastes like chocolate milk, but I don't like chocolate milk. Can I address it? Yes. <laughs> but I'll try the, it the kids again. will drink it, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so, eh. It's good chocolate milk, though. True Moo's excellent chocolate milk. Yeah. All right, next <clears throat> I've got Hershey's Peppermint Bark Bells. She can open anything with her teeth, by the way. Little known fact. Okay. Like those little tags on your clothes. <laughs> I have to cut those off with scissors and she's just like gone. I got really good uh, incisors. Is that what these are? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. I don't. That's what I use them with. So here's the bag. I got these at Walmart in their seasonal section. Oh, these are the bells? Section. These are the bells. It's like a Hershey's Kiss, right? Oh, I was right? just going to take a bite out of this one, but you your own. There's lots in there. I'm trying to not these eat like, a whole lot of this. These are basically like Hershey's Kisses, right? Like it's just normal. They're just in the best I shape think of a so. Bell. No, it's got white chocolate. I mean, it does, but I'm saying like a normal bell is just like a... It's just chocolate. It's just chocolate, right? So, so I'm yeah, assuming it has like... A little white chocolate Oh, it's got a pretty little star on the top. Oh, it's it already yeah. melting in my finger. Oh, those are harder than I thought they were going to be. I'll put the whole thing in my mouth. Mm. The, the topping is kind of pepperminty for mm -hmm. sure. This tastes just like... White and chocolate bark. Mm -hmm. Have you guys ever made it or purchased it from like a school fundraiser? It's really good. That's good. That's the second most peppermint mm -hmm. flavor so far. And the chocolate is good, melting your mouth. Mm -hmm. Definitely really peppermint. <clears throat> Pepperminty. For sure. I shouldn't have put the whole thing in my mouth though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Taking some time. That's why our that's why our food video takes so long. We uh -huh. actually eat the food. You eat too much. <laughs> okay. Oops. Let's do Tic Tac. I hate Tic Tacs. You hate Tic Tacs. I, I love them. Tic Tac like, candy canes. They're pointless. They're not mints. <clears throat> like they're refreshing they're... your breath. They don't. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. And they have. Oh my gosh. These are probably too tiny for me to show you. Maybe you can see yeah. it inside, yeah. but. Each little Tic Tac oh, yeah. has a tiny candy cane on it. Yeah, I couldn't even get it up there and show you guys. That is so there. tiny. Yeah, but there's a little candy cane imprinted on there. That's hilarious. I mean, you normally just like suck on a Tic Tac, mm -hmm. like a mint. It's not like mint or gum. Mmm. That's a weird flavor. I still have the chocolate <clears throat> from the bell in my mouth. I put it. I ate the chocolate on one side, and I'm eating the Tic Tac on the other side. <laughs> that's hard. I figured that might help. That's kind of weird. It's more minty than peppermint, but I well, can't think of the mint. Experiment? Kind of, and not candy cane. Yeah, experiment. Yeah, definitely spearmint. Not. I know that because all the mints we eat at the office. Oh, okay. It's yeah. It's mm -hmm. definitely not candy cane. I don't feel like it is. Yeah, not pepperminty at all. Okay, let's do something light. Okay. Boom chicka pop. So. I see this all over the place in grocery hauls and there's a few YouTubers that I watch that are in love with this stuff. And I first had it, I think in our last taste with, test, with the white holiday. With peppermint or this like? No, 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 no. Popcorn. this popcorn, boom, okay. chicka pop. Got it. 
Um, I, we did have we did have the holiday yep. drizzle or something like that. Yeah, we did. It was so good, so good. I did eat like half of that bag. I only ate it on video, <laughs> on camera. You didn't like it? No, I didn't get any of, uh, of it after that. Oh yeah, because Paige and I ate it. It was, <laughs> it was so good. It was gone. So when I saw that. this, I was like, oh, I'm picking it up. So this is again the holly drizzle, but this one is white chocolate and peppermint flavored kettle corn. Because I'm not a big popcorn fan, like movie theater popcorn, like the typical American. <laughs> but I love kettle corn. So I'm gonna have to start buying this for me. It's supposed to be, you know, a little better for you. Can contains nothing but ingredients you'll love. It's gluten free, 140 calories per it serving. It does have white chocolate on it though. Yeah, so. I like both kinds of popcorn. I don't, I don't, I don't discriminate. This. It smells like peppermint. Does it? And it has little, so it does have white chocolate on it. And then it has some like little candy cane pieces. Definitely smells uh, popcorn y though, too, yeah. like kettle corn. Mm -hmm. This kettle corn is sweet, right? Mm -hmm. A little sweeter. Yeah, it's uh, drizzled in here. Mm. That's really good. I like it. It's light, it's not like chocolate and peppermint in your face. But it does taste like white it. chocolate and peppermint. Yep, absolutely. I like that a lot. Yeah, that's really good. I won't get it's any more of this. It's not too strong. <laughs> It'll be all be gone. Just leave it on my that's side. That's how I go tomorrow night. Okay, let's do something cold. Mm, let's do it. Of course, ice cream always comes out with the flavors that you're looking for. I mean, I don't think you could pick a flavor and go and not find it in ice cream form. I mean, a normal flavor, yeah. not some funky, weird one. I'm not getting like Indian food ice cream. Yeah. I'm not seeing that. Maybe. But that. dessert wise, so this is Dryers, <clears throat> the slow churned. It's called Peppermint Wonderland. It's peppermint light ice cream with peppermint candy pieces. So, it's better limited than pretty edition. Peppermint. Yeah. And so it's slow churned, so it's nice and well, it's been sitting yeah. out for a few minutes. So it's been sitting out for a little bit. Make sure you get some of that peppermint mm -hmm. in there. Let me get this piece right here. Oh, it smells like peppermint. Yeah, I like to smell it and see what it smells mm -hmm. like. Mm. Yep, I can smell the peppermint. That's really good. It's definitely peppermint, but it tastes like a light. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like the slow churn too, because we don't really buy ice cream that often. Only when we're doing for a taste test, really, or a birthday party yep. or something like that. Party. But I like the slow churn by dryers it because it's so soft. I didn't get a crunchy piece. Huh. Oh well. But I didn't chew it. I could have easily swallowed I, it I, and I, not I, known. Yeah, maybe. But that's good. That was really good. <clears throat> Let's keep I the peppermint flavoring stuff like together. What do you think? The what? That oh, one. Well, the thanks. stuff that we like? Well, that's stuff we like. The stuff that actually tasted like peppermint. Oh. Put that over there. Just so we can compare. Okay, okay. These are the things that taste like peppermint. If you like So that. these are peppermint. These are not, right? Yeah, not so much. And then that wasn't the chocolate milk. Yeah. We know the candy canes were. You want to do, we got two more okay, drinks. Okay, start quick clean up in the middle there. We got two more drinks and uh, three more food items. So want to do a drink? Sure. Okay, what are we going to do? Let's do the coffee. Okay, here's the coffee. Cup. All right, so we already poured, and it's not peppermint coffee, it's peppermint creamer. Yep. I'm sure they have peppermint coffee. So the coffee that we are using is just the regular donut shop. Then we added some of the International Delight. Yep, International yes, Delight. And it's peppermint mocha. So it should taste like chocolate and peppermint. Chocolate peppermint. I don't know if you guys caught that, but I totally just burped in my mouth. <laughs> Sorry. All right. It feels like it's cool enough. Yeah, maybe. can sit up a little and with no sugar or anything like that. Yeah, we didn't put sugar in it because... So we could taste that. I didn't really flavor. taste it. Ah, it's still a little warm. All I taste is the coffee. Yeah. I'm going to drink a little bit of this and see. <laughs> Whew! I'm surprised I don't taste... That coffee must be strong. That's really good. But I do not taste it in the coffee. Maybe we didn't put enough. I don't taste the peppermint that much. I, t I definitely taste more mocha, but it is. The peppermint is there. It's good. That side of the table, then. Okay. Well, it doesn't. it's not strong peppermint. This side of the table. That then. side of the table. Do you need more chocolate milk in here? Okay. M&M's, man. Oh, 
right. M&M's comes out with a lot of flavors too. M&M's and Oreos. M&M's for the score. So this is white peppermint. So I'm assuming it's like a white chocolate. And I gotta think that this is gonna taste like peppermint because they come up with all these new flavors like when they do the coffee, this coffee nut and the chili and yeah. something else earlier this year. Ooh. And it always tastes pretty on point. My flavor one, coffee nut. Who makes M&M's? Mars, maybe? I think Mars, it's Mars. yes. Mars, M&M's, talking to you. I need a sriracha flavor M&M. <laughs> Really? Just, yeah. I guess sriracha and... Sriracha makes everything better. And chocolate? Sriracha makes Spice everything better. Spice and chocolate? Ooh, there's, a, there's a YouTube video by Red Link. Sriracha, does sriracha make everything better? I just don't like the taste of sriracha. I don't it's know. because you don't like spice. Alright, these are um, a little bigger than the normal M&M. They're not as big as a peanut M&M, but it's a little bigger. Yeah. Mm-hmm, and it is white. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's white chocolate and M&M. I mean, oh, yeah. white chocolate mm -hmm. and peppermint. You got M&M's. There's a lot of peppermint. It's a little, that's a little strong. I like, got the nose. It is strong. Tingling. Okay. Okay. This needs to be last. Yeah. Twinkies. So we did a Twinkie taste test a while ago. And it was the original Twinkie versus the deep fry that they came out with. Oh, we did. That's right. And... As a kid, I love Twinkies. Twinkies and oatmeal cookies and ho-hos. You mean oatmeal cream pies? Oatmeal cream pies, yes. That's what I used to eat the heck out of. Yeah. And I hadn't had one in years. Like we don't we don't typically buy this kind of stuff for the kids. Um, yeah. We buy other <laughs> bad stuff for the kids yeah. in place of this. But eating those Twinkies, I was like, oh, I really used to like these. They didn't, I remember them being like moister. Fluffier, I don't know. Yeah. They, they tasted kind of dry. Yeah, a little bit. They weren't expired or anything. So, I'm pretty sure, didn't they? I like, don't know how these are going to taste. Didn't but they like shut down Twinkies there for a while? Oh, oh. I, don't, I have no idea. Mm -hmm. But these are white peppermint Twinkies. So, they are white fudge covered sponge cake with a creamy peppermint filling. Hmm. So, yeah, we'll we're going to share those. one, yes. Yeah. Just because last the last taste test we did, I didn't like them. So the kids do in the eating some of this stuff after you buy all of it. Yeah, I mean we don't. I don't go out and buy ho hos for yeah, the kids. Yeah, it's not like every week I use like yesterday. You know, so that. But I feel like I should stop with the taste test for a while because I definitely go overboard. I just go to the store and I see stuff and I'm like, oh, that would be interesting. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, that's melting already. It just smells like a Twinkie. Kind of tastes like a Twinkie. I don't taste any peppermint. Uh -uh. I'm just gonna do the filling because that's where the peppermint is. There's no peppermint in this filling, like none. Well, I can taste peppermint. a little bit of it because it's the sprinkles on the top are definitely peppermint. I think, maybe not. <clears throat> I don't taste it. I think they're just sprinkles. Okay, just sprinkles. It does not taste like white peppermint at all. Let's try one more. Not pepperminty. Mm -mm. Yeah, and I don't really like it. I'm not a big fan of the Twinkie anymore. I ate all one. Same. I ate it to see if the peppermint would, would come, mm. but no peppermint. All right. Next huh. to last? All right. Is it next to last or second to last? I always say next to last. Next to last? I don't know. <sighs> all right. Okay. So this is a peppermint herbal tea. I love coffee in the morning and tea at night. <laughs> hold what? Hold what? Oh, I know. I was going to show. Oh. <laughs> so we did go ahead and put the bag in here so it was steeping and getting ready. Hold on. Oh, sorry. What? Oh, and we put a little bit of honey. But you guys can't smell this. Oh. But when you open that box, it immediately, I mean, it's, it's super strong peppermint yeah, smell. Yeah, it's really strong. So I'm wondering if it's going to taste as, as strong. Super strong. Oh, and it's cooled off enough to... There you want to... So I'm going to squeeze it out. And all they are, individual baggies, no string or anything like that. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, celestial seasoning. Yeah, smell it now that it's open. Wow, that is really it's, strong. It's, it's, like, it's like you shove the candy cane up your nose. Yeah. Okay. I'm assuming this is going to be very 
It's going to have a lot of peppermint taste to it. Don't spoil it for me. Don't spoil it for me. Okay. I'm not saying a word. I can smell it for sure. Get my chair moving. Oh, not really. Oh, I, I feel the mint like tingling in my mouth. Yeah. yeah. But the that. taste isn't there. Does that make sense? Yep. Like I feel the the effect of mint when you're eating chewing like gum or yeah. eating a candy cane, but the taste is kind of off. Opens it up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't taste like peppermint. It smells like it, big time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like when it hits your tongue, it it's tingly. A little tingly peppermint or mint but, taste. Yeah, but you don't really taste it. Mm. But the it's, smell is... Yeah, you smell it for that's sure. That's so weird. Huh. Mm. Tea's weird. That's weird. Okay, last is gum. This was also at Target. It's a gourmet gum. They had a ton of different flavors. There was red velvet, there was birthday cake, but then I saw the candy cane, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna pick it up. And it's, on the back it says, not a low calorie food. Okay. <clears throat> well, huh. I just saw that. Oh, yeah. So it is sugar-free, seasonal edition candy cane, and it does come in a resealable pouch. Hmm. So once you open That's it and get a piece out. Gum, all right. mm -hmm. Hmm, it smells sweet. A little chick tip. It's like an orbit type gum, a little hard yeah. shell. Hmm. That is really strong. Mm-hmm. I don't know if it's so much pepperminty as it is just minty Mint, in general. Yeah. What makes peppermint peppermint? Like? Right. Yeah, because there are different flavors of peppermint. I mean, of mint. Mm -hmm. But that's definitely a strong minty flavor. Oh, mm -hmm. put that over there. Yeah. That's a no. I feel like it's half and half. Yep. Seven and six items and six items over there. Wow. So pretty much half and half. <sighs> that was a weird taste test, though. Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I often Just, don't know. What you're just now, getting peppermint. To, to note though, all the all the drink items yeah. are over here in the non peppermint um, stack. So for whatever that's worth. Mm -hmm. We've got the ice cream, the chocolate, the gum, the candy cane, and the popcorn over here. Now something else that I like that's this gum. Maybe not surprising is that if I had to pick my favorite, it's going to come out of that stack. It would not be anything over here. Yeah. Oh, those what's your um, What's your favorite? Mm, my favorite. What's your favorite pepperminty? And then do you have one that you like from over here, even though it's not peppermint? Um, I would say maybe the popcorn. I like the popcorn I like the popcorn. too. Popcorn is really I can good. see I like the white that. chocolate also. Mm -hmm. And then over here, um, probably the peeps. Me too. I like the peeps. High five. Yeah. I like the peeps. They're good. I like the peeps too. But and I like the popcorn. That's why we're married, folks. <laughs> <coughs> All right, well, that was another taste test. I'm gonna to try to stay away from the taste test for a while. Yeah, at least through December, geez. Geez, yeah. <laughs> well, there's not really a taste test holiday in January where they come out with flavors. Not really. <laughs> you can something different. Yeah. Like peppers. Maybe, ooh, no. We yeah, need to do peppers. You maybe guys a need funny, to, maybe a funny challenge. You guys need to give us a bunch of likes on this video. Food challenge. For peppers, because it'll be hilarious. See her eat pepper. She hates right. hot stuff. If so, do we want to say like if it gets so many likes, then we'll do a pepper? Because I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> do you remember that one time at band camp? No, I'm just kidding. When we went to Willie's, uh huh, and I asked pickles? for fried pickles, and I don't, I didn't look at them. I was just eating them, talking, <sighs> and all of a sudden my mouth was on fire, and I thought I was gonna throw up. They stuck fried right jalapeno there. in there. <laughs> I ate a fried jalapeno. It was horrible. <laughs> It was horrible. I was sweating. My face was red and all blotchy. It's a horrible experience. I will never forget it. Now, every time I get fried pickles from anywhere, yeah, she's making. She's like, I look at it. <laughs> Make sure you don't get a jalapeno. It's funny. So, if this video gets some likes, we'll do a pepper challenge. You're gonna have to pick out the pepper soap because I know nothing. I don't even cook with peppers hardly ever. I know. 
<laughs> Poor you. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, so give this video a thumbs up and we'll have a challenge coming up in the future. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that video. That, that video. Go, too much peppermint and talking about peppers is freaking me out. If you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that button. <laughs> I was about to say it again. Because I do post every day. And I know I've said this in a couple videos already, but I know I'm not doing my giveaway until January, but I did hit that thousand subscriber mark. Yay. And yeah, I was super excited. I took a screenshot of it the second I saw it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I was so excited. Thank you so, guys. So I awesome. will be having a giveaway for my subscribers to thank you guys coming up in January because it's my birthday month. And I want to celebrate with you guys. It's a whole month of birthday. <laughs> yes. <laughs> because it's going to be my best year ever. I'm turning right. 33. But I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.